you teach other people how to love you mm-hmm. by the way you love yourself. Yeah. And that really, it's mind blowing when you think about that, you know, and if you, if you think you might have an issue or you think you might have something unconscious running in your brain, look at your relationships right now. Are your relationships loving and kind and supportive? If they're not, stop and ask yourself, how can I be more kind to myself? How can I be more supportive to myself? How can I be more loving to myself? And once I flipped that script, I was like, oh, okay. If I want someone to cherish me, I need to cherish myself. If I want someone to adore me and think I'm beautiful, I need to adore myself and think I'm beautiful. And again, the best way that I know to consistently get those new thoughts into your mind and your body, more importantly, is through EFT affirmations, journaling. I would, I would, when I was really changing, I would say, you know, I deserve to be cared for. I deserve to be loved. I deserve to be held. And I would imagine myself with somebody with their arms around me and I would just be, and I would tap it and just really bring it into my body somatically that I deserve this. And then once I did that for a period of time then my whole life switched, I started to, it's when I found my yoga teacher training, I started to have more opportunities to love myself more in my life. And that's when I got my relationship. 